with all the uh, guys you've gone through in the secondary with dealing with injuries over the last month, has it gone about as well as could be expected back there? Oh, yeah, it's going pretty good. Um, everybody in the room understand, next man up, um, and you got to come out and execute. When you're the coaches, you used the word professional initiative and speaking about you guys having the autonomy, like the ability to just kind of make plays beyond the scheme. Yeah, it's it's unique. Um, it's it's all about you know what's coming, and um, when we know what's coming, uh, each guy give a guy a heads up of what's coming. Um, whether we in that zone or they in that zone, to help them play it better, and it's all about communication. When you're given that ability to just kind of like take ownership of a play being made, like does that kind of like kick in the gear a little better? Uh, it just shows that, you know, the, the coaches have trust in us, uh, what we do and how we take the approach each and every week, and uh, we're just going to continue to do it. And then on that, that interception that Byron had, he said that, you know, you guys had communication. You were telling him about the quick game. Can you just kind of take me through that, that whole process? Uh, I recognized the formation, and um, I know he was dropping down, and I was running out. So I just gave him a heads up, and um, he made a play. Can you give teammates tips that will help them this week based on your experience? With the Saints? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna give them, you know, much as I much as I know. Um, Tannehill already been in my head already. Um, guys in the defensive back room been in my head, so I'm gonna give them much tips that I remember. And if I hear some calls on the field that I know and I remember, then I let them know. What's the main thing you would tell them? Maybe especially as it relates to Alvin. Uh, just everybody swarm to the ball. Um, we don't need one man tackling. We need everybody tackling him because he's dangerous with the ball. And um, just go play fast. It's a change. Your approach when it's Taysom Hill and quarterback? Uh, not really because we're going to look at him on the back end as a quarterback um, and just play with what's called and within the scheme and then whatever happened, we're going to run to the ball and fly around and make the play.